sorry about that guys I've started it again because the beginning of the stream I was just talking to the, the neighbour so I thought that's not really something I really want to keep on the stream I can hopefully keep this one up now yeah you're going in now I've just done another stream and you know when daddy bought Ninny we got I didn't think he would to be honest and he has so okay you go and talk to your friends and mummy will stay here I'll tell you what guys I'm gonna have a cuppa with you and then I'm gonna go in because I've got some housework to do so Jack's counted seven ladybirds um Mal Mal we need to move this because oh my goodness are they dead or alive Oh, they're alive. Okay. Um, looks like they've been kissing. I don't know what to do with them. And then they need to be away from the dog. I'm going to have to move you guys. I'm not... No, 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 no. No. I'm going to have to move you two. But I will move... I don't know what this is stuck to your shelf. But I'm going to move you together. What was that? Oh, my back. This is agony. This is... Oh god, they're stuck to the ground. I'm sorry guys, I'm not going to hurt you. I'll have to ask Al. I think they're um, asleep. No, they're not going to move. Jack, we've got a problem. There's two snails here. I came over here to move this because the gar when the gardener comes, he'll cut all these back. Um, but the dog keeps on chewing them and they're bloody sharp. I've just caught myself. Um, and then I've seen these two snails, Jack. We've got a problem, mate. Oh. Oh, out. No, Gizmo will chew them. No, 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 they're there. They're there, but I can't pick them up. They're stuck. You'll have to ask Daddy. They're really like stuck uh, to the floor. My, uh, my, my friend is um, it's going, it's going out. Your friend's going out. Is she upset? Uh, no. That you that you disappeared? No. Just bloody pricked myself. Um, can you do? I just don't want Gizmo to pick them up, that's all, and hurt them, but they're proper, like, wedged to the ground. Yeah? What, can you come here first? Thank you for those of you that have come back. I'm going to sit down in a minute. Uh, hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Is that... Hello, Glenn, how you doing? That's Glenn, is that? Right, see these two snails here? Yeah. They're proper glued to the ground. I can't lift them up. They're suckered. Right. But the dog will, so will spot them, won't he? And he might pick them up. And they look right. They're having their cuddle. Right. Well, I'll leave them then. Well, what if the dog sees them and hurts them? They're big, aren't they? What's that? Is that part of a bee? Yeah, that way. It's part of a bee there that was stuck to them. I've well, just pulled it off. Way. Yeah, you, yeah. Uh, no, do you know what I would do? What are you doing? Aren't you making that a bit worse? What's that going to do? Do you know what I would have done? Tell you what you should do. Get the spade and lift up the dirt underneath them and then lift them up as a whole because you can't get them off the dirt. They're stuck. So get the spade. I'm going to do that. What are you doing? No, no, no. All you need to do... What are you doing? Making a little house, darling. That's not going to do anything. It is. It's protecting for now. What I would have done... No. You've made it more of a thing. Yeah, because we've, we've, we've shown them where he is. Right. What? Not picking them up and disturbing them and, and everything else. I don't right? mean pick them up. Well, all we can do is put a few bricks around them and then that's it. What I meant was is pick up the dirt underneath them so that they're actually just moving the whole house. And then... Do you know what I mean? So you're not actually pulling them off the ground and then just put them in the bush a little bit. Okay, anyway, I'm back now. Um, I'm actually, like, I care about snails. Now, I know people think that that's ridiculous, but I don't really care. Now, Momo's obsessed with it now, but I put... Okay, hello, everybody. We're having a... We're having a just a little chill. Now, it's very windy. Let me know what the weather's like where you are. Uh, me and Glenn were just talking. Um, lots and lots of golden nuggets, and there's more to come as well. Yeah, big up Glenn. I'm not even going to try and say that name, but we're going to just say it's the Roman numeral channel. That's all I can say now because they're Roman numerals. Okay, we have 
Orange, where have you been, mate? Blimey. And we're back. The first person to comment was, I can't, gosh, David somebody. I can't, he won't let me read. David Edwards, hello. Louise is here, Sassy. Glenn, yeah? You're getting brain freeze? Yeah. I'm not surprised. Uh, Louise, hello, my lovely. Carl and Shell. Space Cat's in the house. Orange. Uh, Agent Orange. Uh, Bev Lizzie, hello, love. Big, big up to Brooklyn. Uh, Sassy, I think I've said to you, how are you doing? Uh, Glenn's in the house, in blue silver, seen so many snails today. A game, exo, charge the snails, rent lot, I like it. Mama Bear to Loki boy, I know my love. I'm going to be doing a bit of looking into the, I know you like the true crime. We're going to be doing a bit of a deep dive into that torso found. I'm not, it might be in tonight. Let me just see what I can pull together. We were in the middle of a storm, Glenn. The storm is called Storm Kathleen. Um, you couldn't make this up, but there you go. We're in Storm Kathleen is causing chaos throughout the UK and Northern Ireland. Uh, who else have we got here? No, Mama, don't, no, leave the hedgehogs. Uh, free set in the house, Lord St Gizmo, Gizmo, come here, no, come to mummy. Leave the hedgehogs, bud. Come on, silly Billy. Okay. No, 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 no. Leave the hedgehogs. Right then. Thank you, game. Jane, Jane is fast asleep. No, she's here. Yeah, so basically, guys, I don't know whether got the people who aren't in the UK won't be aware of this. They found on a nature reserve in Manchester, which is that area again, up there, up northwest, next to Lancashire, where all the, all the people keep for, uh, falling into rivers and canals. Um, and the canals is in Manchester. They found a torso in a nature reserve. Come here, right? And they're saying that, um, hang on a minute. It's Mal, it's only been there a few days. And it's someone that's over 40. I think it, it could be Derek Clayton. I don't know, I, I, that's just me. I'm just looking at, stop it. Dirty. You've got your own food. Leave the bloody hedgehogs alone. No, Mama. Stop it. No. Go on. We're off. We need to seriously. We're going to have to use Nini Wig's pen to corner this area off, guys. Um, and get Nini Wig another one. Because he won't leave them alone. And we're going to have to just cut a hole out of it so that they can come and go. Leave the hedgehogs alone. So, what I was thinking of doing was, I don't know if it'll be tonight, I'll see, is get a bit of research together on what we know so far and, and look at who's missing in the area. Come on, stop it now. There's quite a few people, but it was, they've said that the body is somebody, it's a torso of, of a man over 40, which narrows it down a tiny bit, not much. Gizmo, please leave the hedgehogs alone. Oh, God, it's chaos. Um, so I know you guys are interested in true crime. Uh, windy, yeah, it's terrible, isn't it? Yeah, I really been went, Dave. I'm, just, I'm reading back on chat. Hello, Elaine, my love. Piggy Wig just landed and Gizmo just changed. Leave Piggy Wig alone. Uh, big up, Dave, how you doing? Yeah, Glenn got the crown. Uh, Rach in the house, morning ish, hello my love, Willie's in the house, uh, that's a good trophy Glenn, uh, the crown goes to Tiffany, uh, Glenn gets the trophy, that torso, yeah it was wasn't it, Manchester, torso fine, Storm Kathleen, you couldn't make it up Glenn, it actually is really called that, I'm not joking, um, pod, how's Phil these days? Um, They keep saying he's going to make a comeback. I think they're trolling us, to be honest. Did you find that cup, that green cup? Yeah. Where was it on the radiator in the kitchen? No, it was lurking in the kitchen. Look at Gizmo, look, he's looking for Piggy Wig, he's on the roof. Piggy Wig keeps landing and Gizmo keeps chasing him off. Oh, it is Piggy Wig. Gizmo, leave Piggy Wig alone. So I think we might do, who wants, let me know if you want me to do a deep dive into that anyway, because, um, look at him waiting. He 
you wouldn't hurt him, he just wants to play. Uh, how's Ninny? So Ninny wigs out. I don't know whether uh, Auntie Kathy, Auntie Kathy, Auntie Vicky's here. Who's Auntie Kathy? Um, there's Ninny. Oh my goodness. Ah. Oh. Uh, Storm Kathleen is causing terror throughout the United Kingdom and, and, and Ireland. Look at him looking up to the roof for Piggy Wig. Watch this, you ready? My Mal, Giz Mal, where's Ninny Wig? Where's Ninny Wig? He's him tilting his head. Where's Ninny? Is Ninny over there? Should we go and see him? We're interested in Piggy Wig. Look at him. Where's Piggy Wig? Is he on the roof? Is Piggy Wig on the roof, Mal? Is that Ninny? Hello Ninny Wig. Where Ninny? Yeah, we need to do something again. We need to pen off these hedgehogs and then we'll cut like a little hole out for them. Ninny! Ninny Wig! Ninny Wig! Ninny! Is that your friend? Is that your friend, Mamo? Oh my goodness! Anybody else got wins this bad? Or is it just... Has everybody else got on this bad? No, Momo, leave Piggy Wig alone. My chat's frozen. Oh God, it's all just come back. Right, I've missed a load of chat. It just said it, there was no chat, no one chatting, and I've just refreshed it and loads just come through. Uh, I've never seen Gizmo's fur blown in the wind like that. I know. It, 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 and he just stands there, doesn't he? Like, it's, look, his stance never changes, look, his stance. Kathleen is blowing my dog around. Hello, Vicky Love. No! Gizmo! Piggy Wig! Jack, Piggy Wig is being bullied by this crazy little um, hound. You're right, bud. Has your friend's gone out then, yeah? Um, Mole Mole, Piggy Wig wants to come and have something to eat. Do you want to sit here? Just don't sit next to that. There he is, Jack. Piggy Wig. Uh, Paula, hello. Doesn't he, doesn't he like the hedgehogs? Oh, I've missed something. Oh, doesn't he like, oh, I don't know. He is a show dog, yeah. Look at him, waiting for Piggy Wig. Uh, 55 watching. I said his name, he looked over like, where, where? Um, 55, 16. Piggy Wig's trolling him now, he keeps landing. He's just landed on the bush. Leave him alone, Gizmo. Just, just FYI, he wouldn't hurt him. He wants to play with him. You could not make Ninnywig a, a bit shorter. I've already asked Al, and he said no. It's impossible. Gizmo's not letting Piggywig land. Oh my goodness! It's gone a bit black over there. Look at that, Jack. Again, there's the sun, and it's been whited out. There's Piggywig. I know what I'm going to do, Jack. Oh, that's not Piggy Wig. That's a, young, that's a younger one. That's not Piggy Wig. What I might do is put some on the fence, Jack. You know what you used to do? Is put a little bit on there. In. Watch my tea. Don't fly off, Jack. What's that in my tea? It's a bloody Barbie, Jack. <laughs> it is. It's a... It is, isn't it, Jack? This is, this is a bloody spider in my tea, guys. Jack, go and give that to Daddy and tell him I'm not drinking it. Look, there's a spider in my tea. Oh, come on! Ugh. Spider gate, snail gate, ladybird gate, pigeon gate, piggy on gate. It isn't piggy wig. It would have died as well instantly because it's hot. Oh. oh, I'm not drinking that. Are you mad? Have you told Daddy there's a spider in my tea? 
All right, Daddy, I'm going to tip it away, OK? Oh, I've got my spider expression tool. I'm not drinking that, Why no. Not? No, It'll take it. I don't care. I'm not drinking it. It's no. Extra bits, extra protein. Stop, stop. I am not drinking it. I don't care what anyone says. I'm not drinking a tea that's had a spider in it. Not at me. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Show me then. Yes, it is. That's a spider. That's a spider. Fact, that is a spider. It's a dead. Yes, it is. It's one of them ones with the little bodies and the big long legs. Isn't it a spider, folks? I can't believe you just made the spider. You're just so cool. Right. Tell me. Where's the camera gone? Tell me that that's not a spider. Why won't it focus? Guys, that's a spider, isn't it? That was in my tea. And I'll just came with a spoon to fish it out. Jack, that's a spider. You can yeah. see it. That looks like a piece of hair. No, it's not. And you know it isn't a piece of hair. It's a bloody spider, Jack. Uh, uh, I mean, it might invent a new drink. Sp spider tea. Spider tea? Yeah. Yeah, but that's up to you. That is a bloody spider. It's a spider. I'm not drinking it. Um, I don't care what anyone says. It's not happening, so... And I do, Daniel. Hello, Jace. That is most definitely a spider, so. Um, Jack, go and take. I'm sorry, Mr. Spider, but go and put that. I started to put that in the wash. I don't know if you're going to even let Ninnyweed drink that tea. I was having a wash, look, look all the way does. It's all go here today. It all, this is why Glenn loves the garden streams, because he said you just don't know what you're going to get, do you? Ninnyweed. Ninnyweed. That was quick. You've made me another one already. What, what have you put in it this time? I knew there'd be something. I reckon. I reckon Al did that spider on purpose. You know. What do you reckon, guys? It would have been blown in from the where somewhere. I know. I'm joking. I know. I know. Take care, Daniel. I don't know why, but I had flashbacks. Do you remember? I don't know if you people subscribers will remember. Do you remember the eighties? And there was there was a couple of the summers. There was massive swarms of green fly. And mm -hmm. you would be at, the, they'd be at the seaside and you'd be actually swarmed by green fly. You'd have to like shake them all off. Do you remember last year when we were at the seaside and there was all them things when we were there with uh, Free Speech? Do you remember that? They, corn, they were corn flies, they? I don't know what they were, but that was weird, wasn't it? Yeah. But this, the, the, in the 80s, the green fly. Yeah, yeah. It was, oh my God, it was horrible. I, I remember looking down at the ice cream, I was only be about. There was, like, there was loads of summers like that in the 80s yeah, and them and little black like things. 10, 9, 10, Jack's age, looking down at the ice cream, it's literally it's gone green. Yeah, so and the little black ones, the little black fly. Yeah, little fly yeah. we lived, we lived um, at the back of the uh, village, so we had all the fields behind us and we used to get all sorts coming in. We used to get field mice as well, door mice coming in. Found one in the oven once, we don't know how it got in there. It must have been, I don't know how it got in there. We opened, opened the oven to put the dinner in and there was some bloody mice living in there. Luckily, I didn't, the oven hadn't gone on, like, you know. Yes, how do they get in these places, these it's mice? You kind of need a whole, like, guys, guys, guys. Sparrows. Sparrows. Um, uh, Gizmo keeps on chasing the pigeon and he's scared now. So I've put some over there. Friends, there he Gizmo, is. He's making friends and alienating people, aren't you, mate? That's what he's doing, yeah. The sparrows are back. Um, it, oh, look at them all. Is there any Oscar fuzz? Because the, the crews are back in town. Here we go. The crews are here. They're going to come and eat now. Right. Go, you, would you go and get some Oscar fuzz? But don't put it out yet because there's... Piggy wig, go on. Mal, mal. Gizmo. Leave him, Gizmo. Good boy, Momo. What's that for? That's Oscar. 
Okay, mom. Hang on a minute. Look, Daddy, Daddy, look. Look, Jack, look, Jack's Daddy, look. Mo, Mo. He's just done a little test. Gizmo, you did really, really well then. Good boy, Gizmo. Did you set up for discipline? He didn't run and chase. Good boy. Piggy Wiggy's there. Oh, it's all go today, guys, in the garden. Oh! Oh my God, the sparrows have all gone now because of that big bust. Right, so because the sparrows have gone, I'll go and put this os... Where's the ospifors? In here? Yeah. You know, yesterday, the, did you see it? I literally put it in and they were putting it straight out. This is some ospifors. When did you get this today? This is what I've been collecting. Well, I got loads yesterday. Oscar Fuzz. So Oscar is like a woolly mammoth. There you go. Honestly, it's isn't it soft, Jack? Feel that. What? Oh, he's on there. I'll just put some food there for him. Mo, mo, not Gizmo. Gizmo! Gizmo! Giz he can't. Gizmo! Not the. Gizmo doesn't get it that not everybody wants to play with him. He thinks that everyone's his friend. Right, so here we go, folks. For those of you that missed it yesterday, this is Oscar Fuzz. So what we do, hopefully they'll come back before it blows off. Blackbirds are over there as well. They're waiting for... All right, I'm putting it, I'm shoving it in the holes. They don't take it from the sides. Okay, so I've shoved it down a little bit. I've left that bit there. Let's see. We're not, it's going to be harder to see it today because it's not as... But we will catch them. Okay, so let's see. Let's go and sit down. Are you supervising again? It's all go today, isn't it? Pigeons, ladybirds, uh, snails, spiders in the tea, hedgehog. Um, poo. I mean, we've had a little pile of poop down there, so bloody um, gizmo. It's obsessed with eating other animals' poop. It's just so gross. Right, let's see if they come. Please let go. Me and Jack watched the Barbie film last night, didn't we, Jack? We watched it in two hours. We watched half last night and half the night before you ready don't let watch it doesn't fall over boy Al's done me another tea something else there but... oi that was horrible gizmo gizmo he doesn't get it does he gizmo 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 mamo the birdie's scared of you mo thinks he wants to be his friend gizmo come on Your lid just flew off. Gizmo! Uh, excuse me, that's rubbish. That isn't how you look at things. Look at the world. I don't need it anyway. No. Pick it up. What the? He just landed on Jack's chair? Oh, Jack, tell, tell Gizmo to not move. Gizmo. Did you see that? He landed on Jack's chair. Gizmo. Gizmo. God, this pigeon must be hungry. This is our resident, Piggy Wig. No, that's not Piggy Wig. Al thinks it is, I don't know. He doesn't look fat enough to be Piggy Wig. Hello, you're hungry, aren't you? We're, fat him. We're not fat shaming him, no. Then why fat? Because Piggy Wig was very fat. Okay. Jack, you're doing really well there. Good boy, Momo. A beautiful wood pigeon there, guys. Gizmo's doing really well. Good boy, Mo. Guys, 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 look, look. There's a blackbird, a female, female blackbird was just looking at the fuzz. No, 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 
no. No, Gizmo, you were doing really, really well until that moment there. He didn't hold it. He couldn't hold it though. He did well, didn't he, to hold it for that long. Can you guys hear this wind? Is it really bad? Oh my God, Jack, look. Look, a baby chick. A chicky wig, look. Jack, chicky wig just went in the pen to see Ninny. Oh my goodness, it's all go today, Jack. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Um, it's all go today, folks. Oh, you know what? Daddy's forgot to put some on the... Uh, Daddy didn't put any any uh, bird seed on top of there. That's why they keep coming. And... You, I'll do it, Jack. Jack, your lid's gone again. It's chaos. Storm Kathleen is causing utter chaos today. Right, this is probably going to blow away, but this is what they want. They want it on here. It's absolute chaos. They will come for that. We had a blackbird just looking at it. Free to a good home, Oscar's fuzz. We're all about the, uh, the upcycling here. You know, Greta Thunberg would be impressed. Reusable. Yeah, it's just fell on the floor. Anyway, yeah, so I was thinking about like doing a bit of um, true crime. But I need to have a good look into it first before I go live about it. Because all I know is they found a, they found some human remains at, at a nature reserve, a torso, a man over 40. That's all I know. It's all over the news uh, in Manchester. Do you know where that nature reserve is? Look at him looking for Piggy Wig. Look, Gizmo. Look at me, Gizmo's hair. Mama, Piggy Wig is... Where is it? There he is, Jack, Jack Piggy Wig. He's dying to land. He's really hungry, Mole. Gizmo, how would you like it if you wanted your dindings and a giant Doberman was, was chasing you? No, a giant pterodactyl. Good boy, Gizmo. Good boy. Good boy, boy Mamo. Guys, look. Momo. Good boy. Momo. Do really well, Mole. Good boy, Mamo. No, Mo Mo! Oh, Mo. guys, this poor piggy. Le Mo Mo! Just set the bird food because the bird eats. He eats everything that anybody else eats. Look at him. Gizmo. Who put that on there? Did you do that, Jack? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Jack's just put some seed on there for him. Look, see. Go on then. And then piggy wig that was lovely off you jack well done don't you dare you little sod jack do you know jack you know gizmo's mommy and daddy i think it's more of the auntie and his uh his gran it's more of the girls the auntie the gran momo and his mom have bit through all the wires again um, you know, you know, don't say the name, but you know the lady where we got Gizmo from. Guys, guys, guys. I don't know her name. Guys, guys, look, 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 it's the man again. Guys, look, look. It's the daddy. Again, it's the daddy. Not the mommy getting the nest stuff, look. Did you see that? Oh no, they've pulled it out and now it's going everywhere. See that that was it's all go here. I can't keep up. There's a pigeon flying. There's there's all sorts happening here, guys. I can't keep up today. We're gonna need more than one camera. It's all go. Now we've got some little chicky are them done it because I can't see. And we're in the middle and we're in the storm. We're in the middle of a storm. There's a little chick. Piggy wig's back, straight in front of the camera. Piggy wig's back. Mo mo. Look, you're becoming his nemesis, mate, and it's not very nice. Just stop. But Gizmo doesn't doesn't do it to be nasty. He doesn't understand. I'm just going to go and put that fuzz back down a little bit. Oh, my goodness. It's chaos, guys. It's chaos. Let me just put this back down. Because 
he's pulled a load out. Did you see the daddy getting it? It's, I didn't know that the men did it. What's the matter? What's the matter? You're not coming out of there. No, no, no. No, you'll cause utter chaos, mate. He's trying to get out, Jack. No, Ninny. Ninny Wig never fights on the bars to try and come out. I wonder why he's doing that. Gizmo, let Piggy Wig come and have some. That's it, Jack. Distract the dog. I hope the ladybirds are okay, Jack. They can't see them. Back now. Oh my god, this has been a bit of a mare, isn't it? I need to lie down after this, I think. Yeah, the ladybirds. Oh, only one. What? How many? Two. One big one, one tiny one. They're the ones from over here. They've travelled far. They must have flew. Yeah. That's that's uh, mommy and baby bug. See. Oh, Jack, that is so cute. That's mommy and baby bug, Jack. Oh. Mommy's baby's got lost, Jack. She's gone the wrong way. Oh, there she is. She's coming. Oh. Oh, they're, they're walking around in the middle of a storm. They're walking around. Mummy's gone that way. Follow mummy. Um, mummy went down there. There's mummy. Jack, where's the baby gone? Has she followed? Jack, where's the baby? There. there. But mummy's down there, baby. There, look. She, she can't. Well done, Jack. That's it. Just sort of try and, try and make her go to mummy. Jack, she's climbed on you. There's mommy there. Good boy, Jack. There we go. Oh, brilliant. Jack's just put him down there with mommy. Right, leave them alone now. Good boy, Jack. Good boy. Oh, oh. oh. Hello. No! Oh. I say something. No, Piggy Wig's now stealth because we didn't even hear him land, did we, Jack? No. It's every time Piggy Wig drops the food, Momo eats some. Because he, he has to have what everybody else has. What have you spilt, mate? Nothing. Oh. Mole, mole. Look at him waiting for him. I think, I think that Gizmo now thinks it's a game. He's only eating the bird food. I don't even think anyone's still here, Jack. There's no comments. Fresh it, Jack, because it says there's nobody commenting. But there's 61 watching. Gizmo never eats the bird food unless the birds eat it. Honestly, it's all going here today. I can't keep up. Yeah? You're not playing with your bow and arrow in this. That's just silly, Jack. I know you want to play with your bow, but that's just... You came out earlier with Daddy and... No. I draw the line, Jack. No. You're not getting your bow out in this. That's just silly. In the middle of a storm. <clears throat> right, let's see if anyone's chatting yet. Because the chat keeps on freezing. Okay. Uh... I remember that, John. Some people still say that. Hello, Jenna. How you doing, darling? You are right. Julius is here. I think Mama needs to poop. Uh, what's going on? Uh, Bridget's here. Oh, I love, I love Port Reef. I've been down there. Uh, that, that is one luxury nest for the sparrows. It is. It is. Mini Nature Reserve. Yeah, is Ryan here? I'm just catching some of the chat back. Whoa, Lisa's here. Ryan's here. Ryan, don't let Mally do know you're in here. Um, she'll have a meltdown. So I'm going to call this Penny is load of us commenting. Yeah, it's frozen. We are chat. It, it's the, it's YouTube. I've lost all my premium. I, I, I pay for premium, right? The 
family plan so that Jack can have it and Al. And I've got ads on people's channels, not my channel, not monetised. Um, and I can't use the back player, like the background player. Hello, Julius. Jack, try and distract him. That's it, Jack's distracting Gizmo. Well done, Gizmo. He has Jane on now. It's depressing, isn't it? Well done, Jack. Can't wait to get Jack to the hairdressers. So what is it today? Six, twelve days of that hair. some uh, red kites the other day circling. I think I caught them on one of the last ones. Ninnywig's distracting him. Well done. Well done, Ninny. Ninnywig's distracting him as well. Well done, guys. Well done. Piggywig's nearly finished that, that pile now. And you can go and onto the enter anything else, and it, it leaves like a little, a little wee window, doesn't it? Like a little telly playing, so I can listen to streams or listen to videos and documentaries whilst I'm like on the internet or whatever. It's not working. I have contacted YouTube, but they haven't got back to me. Mobile. What's it? It's like a cat. Sparrows. Have Mau Mau! Hiya! Jackie's finished it all. I smell cigarette smoke a mile off because I'm an ex-smoker. Blimey. I can smell his fag from down there. I don't know, I've been giving up smoking, Jack, for 22 years now. Jack, watching by the hedgehogs. Hello, everyone. He's run out, Jack. We're going to have to go and get some more to him. Jack, oh there he is, he's just had another wig. Right. Piggy wig. Jack, don't, don't. Jack, take it from that one. Don't keep getting it out because he's. No, that one. Just put some. Mau Mau. Don't smoke anymore. I just smolder. <laughs> A lot of people don't realise that. They, they, they don't, they think, they, they don't think I used to. Oh! Mau Mau, are you okay? You tripped. They don't, they say, God, you used to smoke them like, yeah? And they're like, I wouldn't have seen you as a smoker. Well, what does a smoker look like? <laughs> you know, I still have dreams about it, even now, over 20 years old, I still dream I'm having, I'm having a fag. I call them fags in, um, I know a lot of people from, from, from the UK don't know what I'm talking about um, when I say I've had a fag. But anyway, I dream that I've had a fag and I wake up like, I can almost smell the nicotine that real? Uh, Alan Edge in the house. I started really young. I think a lot of us did in them days. It's, it was cool then, it's now vaping now. Yeah? yeah okay. and they've said that vaping isn't healthy. It'll come back to, you know, I always said that from day one when I gave up the work, no vaping, but I did say that that, it's going to come out that that's really unhealthy. And it's coming out. Oh, for God's sake, Jack, it's it gone. It does cause lung damage. Jack, can you do me a favour? Can you go and get me a couple of wipes out the bathroom wall? Because look, it's gone everywhere and it's all sticky. Quick, Jack. Okay, go and get me some 
some uh, wipes. So something, Jack, was that your... Oh, my God. Now, the, the his drink's gone, and now it's going to make the table all sticky. Oh, God, it's chaos, chaos. Where's the dog gone? Mama! Yeah, I still dream about it. It's really weird. I dream that I'm having a smoke. I also dream that I'm eating meat. I had a dream last night that I was eating a steak bake, which is like a pasty, for those of you who don't know. That I went to Greg's and I bought myself a steak bake and I ate half and then I lost it. And then I went and bought a cheese pasty. I dreamt these things. I haven't eaten meat for 10 bloody years. really weird isn't it how things stick in your head you don't even think about them i don't even think about me i'm not interested i don't miss me i don't miss banks unless i get um, a big whiff sometimes like i just had then it was like oh that smells nice hello you hello monster you okay should we go in now yeah he needs a good bath we're waiting for his new... Well done, Jack. He's come back now. Look. Oh. Uh, sassy. No! Gizmo! Jack! You little munchkin. He thinks it's a game now. Gizmo thinks it's hilarious. What time's your friend coming back, Jack? I thought you gave up smoking, Jane. He's back, Jack, Jack, distract the dog, distract the dog. Gardener's coming next week, by the way. So, Al's got rid of the Christmas tree, though. Look, he's put it in the brown bin. Um, he's the weather pending, he's going to come. You are right. If it is Piggy Wig, he's lost some weight. Oh, no, there's Piggy Wig. I'm telling you. Right, the bigger of the two. Oh, he's got something on his beak. Well, yeah, there we go. That's Piggy Wig. Yeah, Piggy Wig's just chased him off. That poor pigeon. Finally, Gizmo leaves him alone, and then Piggy Wig comes and chases him off. Pigeon Gate. Pigeon Gate, guys. Pigeon Gate. Look. Why has he got that on his beak? beak? Yes, yeah, so tomorrow night we're going to be covering and do a pre-eclipse show and we're going to be covering the turning on of CERN. Um, we're going to be looking at some dates, some numerology. Um, we're going to be looking at some dates and we're going to be... Jack, Piggy Wig or whoever this is, well, I'm so lost now on who's who, he's, has taken that one's food and we know who's who because he's got a... a feather stuck to his beak like he's some sort of like you know the way you've got like the gremlins and you had stripe who was the the big bad gremlin and he had the spike or you know the, the gang leader this this one's got a feather on his beak like he's saying yeah I, you know i've i've had so many pigeon heads you know like i'm hard and these these feathers here uh, uh, you know are my trophies going to come and get that fuzz jack there's about rosa back there in the bush look at this weird sky look at this right i don't know if you can see this but it looks like um looks like a rack of ribs or something i can't explain how it looks i don't know if you can see this on the camera but in real life oh oh hello right so no 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 ah It's all go, Jack. I can't cope. So that poor pigeon there has had the, has had the head honcho with his little feather, like his trophy. It's like he's taken out so many pigeons and he's got this little trophy on his beak. Um, Jack, we need... Jack, can you do me a favour, mate? Jack, can you go and put a little pile over there for that one? I, I, I'm lost on who's who now, to be honest. Daddy knows Piggy Wig. He says he's got certain stripes. I'm going to be streaming tomorrow night from in the house. Tomorrow night will be the pre. Um, I need to lie down and a fag. I really do. After this stream. Yeah, just pop it down, Jack. Oi, leave him alone, you bully. 
put it down, Jack. That was definitely Piggy Wig. I can just tell by the noise that he makes. Right, okay. Right. Jack, I think the birds want to come and get some food, Jack, so you're going to have to, like, sit down for a minute. Hello, Nanny Love. How are you doing? Um, what's going on here? Jack? You all right, mate? What's happened? Okay, no. Hey? Right. It's all going. I cannot cope. Oh, mini wigs popcorn! And did you see that, Jack? The back, the back on the fuzz. Oh, they were just back on the fuzz, Jack. Did you see mini wig popcorn in there? You don't know what a mini wig popcorn is. They like they they jump and hop. Did you see that space cat caught it? Didn't you, love? Jack, mini wigs put the popcorn in. Look, look, it's popcorn in, Jack. He needs more room. We usually just let him run around, but he he kept on bullying Oscar. And if we let him out now, um, he's mobile chasing. So we've, we've devised a plan um, for when everybody's out, when everyone's out, and we're going to have Gizmo on his lead, but in the garden. So I'm going to get a retractable lead so we can take him as far, and then so that everyone can come out at the same time. Because but Gizmo is going to have to go on a lead while Oscar comes out. And until until Gizmo gets used to the fact that he has to, you know, not chase Oscar. Um, well done, Jack. Well done. Now, Jack, that that piggy wig came, and um, pig, the other piggy wig. Jack, Jack, look, a baby sparrow. Jack, he's gone to see Ninny. Look, baby sparrows in with Ninny. Look. Oh, Jack, I wonder if Ninny wigs. Gizmo spotted him. Mamo, you okay, Mo? We're birdie. We're birdie, Mamo. It's the way he tilts his head when I talk to him. It's the cutest thing I've ever seen. I don't know because uh, Gizmo's here now, so I'm very intrigued to see what Nini Week's going to be like this year. Because last year it was a terror. And the year before. We've been doing these garden streams for years. There's just more people coming to them now. Jack, can you please give Ninnywig some attention? He feels left out, Jack. Oh look Jack, keep him up, Jack has come back, no that's not the badass one with the, with the feathers on his beak, the notches on his, on his, not on his head This is probably the most chaotic stream I've done this year. And it wasn't planned either, it only came out because of the dog. I love animals more than I love the taste of meat. I cannot cope. Can't cope, Bev Love. No, Ninny Weave doesn't like all the people. Oh my god, the birds are in the bird bath, Jack. Hold on. Guys, look. Oh, a ladybird is what? Not a ladybird, a butterfly. 
There's a butterfly sat next. Oh, you can't see it. There's a butterfly next to the bird. Oh, you can't see it on the camera. There was a bird in the bird bath. <laughs> the birds just sat there. No, Ninnywig, Ninnywig actually plucks other animals fur. He, he eats, he eats hair as well. Jack's give up. Look, time out, time out. You're right. He stepped on your hand. Oh. Well, it was an accident, Jack. Can you see how he stands with his legs turned, his feet turned slightly outwards? That's a show stance, that is. I've been told that his patch doesn't make any difference, so it's not matching because of everything else about him. Jack is eating it all again, look. No, Ninnywig absolutely loves Daddy. He's more, he, he's he loves his dad as Ninnywig does. Um. <laughs> and the banana. <laughs> Let him take it, Jack. Doesn't want it now because Jack's dropped it. Look. Just waiting for his new bath towel to come. I've bought him a dog robe, a proper dog robe that's got. I'm having his. I've had his name embroidered on it. Jack's fine, he said. Um, when that comes, we'll bath him and we'll wrap him up in his posh robe after. Well, oh, I'll put something on the the members channel. Guys, guys, look, look. No! Oh, Momo, there was little dunnocks then. Momo. Oh. He ran out of food, Jack, he ate it all. It's definitely more chaotic and all we've got out is Ninny and the dog. It's a million percent more chaotic. I think they're gonna look they're gonna go for that again. And we're in the middle of a storm as well, remember? We're in the middle of a storm here. Oh no, he did snake kips. It's doing snake hips to Jack's arm. These birds are waiting for me to put some food on there and I can't because I did, it blows off. I'm sorry guys, it blows off. You'll have to come to the feeders. Well, we don't want to go in the feeders because you're there. Jack's given up. Hello, Skip. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, they're in Nini. Oh my God, they're in Gizmo's den. Jack, distract Gizmo. They're cheeky wigs, look. Look, oh, look, hello. Didn't I just say come over and get some food? And they did. I think they heard me. Toxic titty, we call her. We don't even give her any oxygen over here. The little chicks, look. Chicks. Chicks are out. Teddy for his snake hips. I was going to get him neutered until... I'm not getting him neutered, daddy there, I'm not getting him neutered. I've got, I've got animal voices for every single thing. What's that? I've just seen a bird go next door I don't think it was anything I've seen before. Oh, they're so small, look. I'm keeping an eye on that fuzz. Jack, you're doing really well distracting him. The birds are all getting some food. Jack, well done, mate. Jack, you're taking one for the team, Jack. Jack's just said, Jack's just put his thumb up to let us know that he's okay. Jack, he's doing snake hips to Jack's arm. Oh my 
my god, there's a black it's pig. It is Jack. It's the view, my <laughs> That's a flat pigeon. Not the one behind it, the one. I've never seen a black pigeon before. Gizmo is knackered. He probably wants to go and get his smoking jacket on now after that. Well. Butterfly! No, he's just killed it! Please tell me. Oh, it was a leaf. Oh, thank God for that. Thank God for that. Oh, my goodness. I thought, I thought he just killed a butterfly. I can't cope. <laughs> Oh my god, this, this is just nuts. And it's, it's non stop. <laughs> Snow kips. Jack just said you can have the banana. Jack, are you okay? You did no, really. I'm traumatised. I'm traumatised. I need to send you to counselling, Jack. Yeah. Guinea pig just ran over so I can get therapy. You need therapy? That was funny though, Jack. You've got to admit that was funny. You were laughing, Jack. You weren't exactly crying. Oh, come on, Gizmo. You know, laughing, I'm crying. No, I said at least you were laughing. You weren't crying. You were laughing, mate. Are you okay now? He's still smiling. He says he needs therapy. Jack. Look, you distracted. I'm traumatized for the rest of my life. Look, Jack. Right, Gizmo was distracted and now. Um, he's um, he's back to looking for the birdies again, Jack. So you allowed the birdies to get some food, Jack. So you did really take one for the team, mate. I did. You did. <coughs> Are you okay? Sit, sit yourself down. Okay. <coughs> I can't deal with that haircut, mate. Honestly, it's doing. It, it, oh. Do you know what? Right. I did it the other day for him after I washed it and. I, I used my posh shampoo and I put some stuff on it and everything. And then he started messing with it and twirled it all up again. Look, Gizmo. I'm going to have to cut it. Do me head in. Jack, you asked for this yourself. Now you've got his other fruit out. He loves it really. Jack says he's traumatising, yet he's back on the floor with the orange now. He says he hates it. He hates it that much, he gets on the floor with another piece of fruit. Ah! Okay, Julius. Just reminds me, I need to do an avocado. Jack makes me laugh. That was so funny, I was dying. I nearly, nearly had to go and get some tenor pads, like, uh, what's her face? Uh, what's her name? Dana, Dana. I love Dana. She's awesome. I just want to get her clippers and just shave Jack's hair. I think I should, you know. Jack, yeah. your hair's doing my head in, mate. I can't, I cannot cope with that for another, another t uh, twelve days. I'm going to start putting it in ponytails, Jack. That'll stop you from. That'll, that'll make me. That'll make you let me cut your hair. Jack, can you go and see him anyway? Because he probably feels a bit left out, mate. <gasps> oh, he's just nearly landed in my face. The piggy went just literally, right? <laughs> this wasn't meant to happen, this street. Um, was it, Jack? We, we only came out because Gizmo wasn't stop crying for Daddy. You, no, yeah, but Daddy only went out because um, you wanted the slushy. But me and you only came out because Gizmo was, was upset. Got a cupboard full of tenors. Hello, cat love. It's insane, darling, here. It really... Oh! Jack, please don't... Please be careful. Jack, Ninny Wig's just blue. It's chaos, guys. It's utter chaos. Where's that pigeon gone? There was a black pigeon on the roof next door. I've never seen one before. Yeah, Southern Lights. They're more, I find the Southern Lights, there's not that much difference, but they're slightly more pinky, pinky, pinky purpley, but they've still got all the green and that, but they just seem a bit more. He'll be back. He just went to land on your chair. He's had a poop on your chair. Oh, no, no, that was already there from yesterday. 
right, I think we're going to go in now. This storm's getting worse. Um, I said to Jack this morning, I said, Jack, I'm not going out in there. He went, can we do a stream, Mom? Because he asks me, he says, can we do a stream? And I said, no, it's too windy. I know, I know. It will look more grown up when he has his hair cut. Um, everyone's saying you look bigger, Jack. Jack, be careful, please. Um, doing cat my lovely you okay yeah that was it so i said to jackal and i'm not going out there in that storm and then we only came out because of gizmo was so when daddy goes out he gets so upset he hates it when one of the family aren't here oh no you've got the orange and the banana <laughs> time is it anyway no wedding today oh it's half five Oh my god, I thought it was only about half two. Yeah, we are in the middle of storm Kathleen cat. Um, so we're in the middle of a storm here. As you can probably hear. Okay, Bridget, darling, look at it. It's Jack, mummy should put yeah, I'm gonna put your hair up in bunches, Jack, if you don't let me shave it all off. I'm only seeing green on southern cam so far. Yeah, they look pretty similar, but I've no, I've, I've compared them side by side when they're at the best. What did you say, Jack? Yep, not I'm gonna, you either shave it or put it in pigtails. Oh. oh, the wind must sound really bad for you guys. Ah! Gizmo has pinned Jack to the map. Yeah, one, two, three. Right, am I hallucinating, Glenn, or did you just change the name on your channel then? And then just changed to uh, or something. That was weird. Have we just changed it? So it's got four. <coughs> sorry, four. Twenty-six. Eleven. Is that right? Play right, Penny. Only been watching for about a week. No, no, yeah. The live stuff is never. I'm on about. You know, when you get the pictures, there's not much in it at all. It's really difficult. Oh, thank you, Cat. He's he's brilliant, Jackson. Just best mate in the world. He's putting um. What are you doing, Jack? We put his toys in his hole now. Jack's hiding his toys and. Jack, do you want to go and get his grape and we'll put that out here as well and then I'll get him a new one for in the house. Jack's hiding his toys in his hole. Gizmo digs holes, doesn't he? Massive holes. You need a drink after that massive slushy. That was weird, Glenn. That was like a glitch then. It was really bizarre. As I was looking at the looking at the comments, um, it it glitched, you named it. It was just weird. Unless it's just my eyes, because the sun's in my eyes, I don't know. He's most knackered now, look. We've got, show the viewers his grape. He's got all this fruit. I bought in lots of fruit. Look. So leave that door. Is Oscar in that doorway? Let him get it, Jack. He loves that grape. Have you heard from Paula Jane? Um, I'll, I'll drop her a message. I've not heard from her in a while. Hope she's okay. Then we've heard from her. I love Paula. She's awesome. He's got his grape now. He's got a grape, a pear, an orange, a banana. Found all these toys. They're only a couple of quid. They're not expensive, and they're made with um, latex, so it's natural. Yeah, I thought so. I was just reading it. I was like four. 26, 2011, no I haven't. Yeah, I like Paula, she's lovely, isn't she? She's been through a lot with these weirdos as well. Just horrible what they did to her. He has, he's got, he's, so he's got, the only one I haven't got now is an apple and an onion and um, 
it feels weird buying them in onion because why would you eat an onion but they're not, they're not actual real anyway so um and the apple they've got they haven't got it in stock in the small they do massive versions as well for bigger dogs um but yeah i love them i'm obsessed with them i'm collecting all, the, all of them and he's got like some in the garden and some in the house i think his grape can become an outdoor one now because he likes that one because it's got bobbly bits on for him to grab hold of Yeah, he needs a good bath. Ah! So windy. Yeah, so I might, might, or I might just do a video actually of that torso with an update on what's going on. Um, <coughs> I might not, I don't really feel like streaming again actually. I've just streamed a lot today. So I'll probably just put a video out tonight and um, we'll be doing a pre eclipse showdown that's not that's not even a word for an eclipse a pre-eclipse um i don't know what's the word what should i call it pre-eclipse oh my god the sun's really bright it's burning my face i'm gonna get some burn who needs a bath the dog we wait for his new bathrobe to come i bought him a bathrobe I managed to find this company and they make them in the UK and they've discontinued some colours and the, Jack's favourite colour was in the discontinued section, Cobalt Blue and it was like half price so I've ordered Gizmo one and um, I know it's really warm though, cat, it's weird um, yeah, the pre-eclipse there's all sorts of toys, I haven't seen the steak one but there probably will be I'm taught that that um, that section, the fruit section, but there's different ones. There's like a there's a there's a technology section, um, and it's the same company and this made out of latex. And there's a bloody floppy disk. No lie, there's a retro technology. There's a floppy disk. I'm going to get them all. Floppy disk, a mobile phone, um, a cassette tape. But I think the cassette tape's fuzzy. Some of them are plush. I don't want the plush ones, I want the, the latex ones. Jack, what are you doing, bud? You're right, Mal, you're knackered now, aren't you? That was so funny, Jack, when he was doing snake hips to you. It's boiling, darling. It's got the wind on. I'm gonna get. I've got sunburn. I can feel it. I totally didn't think because it's windy and hot. I know. I remember floppy disks. Um, oh my god! Yeah. So I'm gonna do a show because I'm gonna try and find out the exact time they're gonna be turning CERN on. Now remember, they upgraded CERN, and then they last turned it on. Uh, I think it was 2022. And hello, me, my love. And it's been off. I didn't, Jenna, no. I didn't know about when was that today. Jack, get out the bloody kids in dirt. Oh my god, the dog's copying him. Look. Look. Jack. Jack, tell Gizmo to do it. He's just started doing it, copying you. Look. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, I have done quite a few, but I probably can do some. I don't know. You have to have so many members to do them. I've not heard about it. I'll have a look into it though. I don't know what Jack's actually doing. But he, got, he keeps going up to Jack and copying him up. Jack, what are you doing, mate? You're making a hole? What, out of Gizmo's existing hole? Are you making it bigger, better? CERN is the biggest hydrogen collider. Anyone that's watched Three Body Problem, um, that, that show, man. 
do you know what I really wanted to do as well? I just don't get the time, and I was going to do it on the Curious Bunny. Was my favourite sci-fi shows? Just do a breakdown of them. Take care, cat, my lovely. <coughs> Have a nice day, sweetie. Just do a breakdown because um, it is really confusing. Guys, 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 look. Guys, it's going everywhere. Just, just imagine Oscar's DNA is in birds' nests all over this town. That's mad, isn't it? It's open or is it just blowing? Blowing. Jack, I can't. Right, hang on a minute, they've gone now. My arms are killing me. Look at that pot. It looks like a weird pot. Where was this, Jack? Uh, I was digging and I found it. Oh, digging under trampoline? Yeah. Jack's just found that, that looks like. But this pot looks weird. Most watching them. They're arguing over the, who, who's got the best fuzz. Who's got the best fuzz. <coughs> it's all the men, look. They're all boys. There's no women. That's another one, another young man. Young man. They're all men. I'm going to. Did anybody ever research this? I need to go and change the water in their bird bath. Why is it all the men? I honestly thought that female birds made the nests. Hello, chick. What are you doing, you two? He gives my bird. Ninnyweed goes over to him, look. Ninnyweed didn't like him, he'd walk off. Trying to lick him, he kisses him. You give him Ninny kisses for Ninny. Mama kisses for Ninny. Come on then. They do. Oh, I was about to go and get Ninny. We can go in, but I think they're going to come back. They're coming back. They're coming back. They're coming back. Look. They're fighting over it. Look, they're arguing. Can you hear them? Hang on, Mo. They're arguing over it. Look. Fighting over who gets the fuzz. Don't worry guys, there'll be more Oscar fuzz tomorrow. Oscar has an abundance of fuzz. I've never known a rabbit that quite like it.
that. I can literally see shadows of them arguing on each other. There's one. See? They're arguing over. Oh, they're back again. Oh, Vicky. Oh, so they. I thought maybe they're just getting the supplies for it to take to the female. So are they actually making it as well? They're not just collecting it for the girls. God, Gizmo's. Oh my God, Gizmo's just got some hedgehog food. Gizmo. Jack. Ah! It's so windy, guys. Mama! No. Gizmo! No, no. Mama! Hey, hey! Dirty! Get out! You! You've got your own bloody food. He acts like he's never fed. Do you know how we how we discovered to do this though? Uh, the one day Oscar was out and I'd given him a brush out here. Look at the last summer. And and a big load of fuzz landed in the bush. It flew into the bush and the sparrows coming to get it. So we start stop eating hedgehog food. <coughs> he's too tired, look. Oh, Jenna, they do. They really do. Dunnocks have the most interesting sex life of all birds in the UK. Jack's not here, so I'm going to tell you really quickly. You get the normal pairs, and then sometimes you'll get a, a two boys and a girl. Two girls and a boy. Uh, different... Oh, no! No! Hold on. Oi! Stop eating. Jack, can you take Gizmo in? If you you've got your own food, silly. Eating that, no. What's this in your hair? Oh guys, guys, they're back. They're back with me, study you. Look. How lovely though that that's Oscar. Animals are amazing, aren't they? Oi, oi, oi! No, no! Dirty, dirty! Come on, in, go in. Some din din. I thought if we din dins, we din dins. Mama, we din dins. Go on, ask Daddy then. Go on then. Go on then, Daddy. If you're watching, can you do Mama's din dins, please? Daddy, din dins. Oh. That's a young one, that one. That's a very young man. So, so do they build it then? Or do they just collect it? Oh. Yeah, Jack, look, look, yeah. Jack, look at the camera, look. Can you see it? Wow. Taking Oscar's fuzz, look. I did I'm, I'm looking at it now. Hang on. I've got to watch the dog as well. Pass it here. I can't tell, you know, what they do. But it's... Hang on a minute, Jack's. Jack, go, go and take his mowing, please. He's hungry. It? Right, so Jack's just keep an eye on him. Let me sit here a second, have a quick look at this before we go. Basically, when they've uh, done the deed, apparently the Dunnock females, uh, the, wor the word that they use for a vulva, but it's like a sack in, in them, it's quite protruded. And when a male has mated with her, it sits in the sack for a bit before it goes anywhere. Well, apparently other males can come along and peck at the sack and empty it out, put their own in. How gross is that? That's Dunnocks. They have a very interesting, uh, so you get like two males to one female, it's really weird. Look at them all, they're all men, look. Yes, Jack? Uh, no, no. Jack can't hear me, it's all right, it's over there. Yeah? Um, I, I, I to, uh, They're doing that with, um, with me and Jack here. I didn't know that my selfie stick extended this far, but it does. You're all right, Mark Mole's hungry, Jack. Crazy, isn't it? That, that, that's what Dunnocks do. Uh, they only discovered it because um, a scientist always wondered why 
not always, but often there'd be like two or three men to a bird or two girls, one man. And it's and they, they studied them in the eighties and they at this university and they watched it happen and they were like, What? They'd never seen anything like it. They've got a very interest yeah. How weird's that though? But then how would they know which who the daddy is of the chicks, do you know what I mean? Anyway, so Jack's just found this, Jack's digging. Because Jack, do you remember we got you that metal detector last year? We're gonna take it to the beach, aren't we, Jack? We might find some treasure. So Jack's just found this and he's just washed it. He's got it as clean as he can. It's a very interesting rock. Yeah? There's a what? Hello, I guess. They're called dunnocks. They look like sparrows, but they're not. They're closest relative. They've only got one other relative in the entire world and they live in the Alps. And they're called Ag, 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 mo, mo, leave the chicks. Hang on, Jack, hang on. They've nearly had the lot, look. They're in our garden. You don't see them very often. They're quite rare. They do look so innocent, yeah? Yeah, I, I, I said the other day, I said, uh, look up Dunnox. And um, Jenna did. Yeah, so Jack's, this rock's got like red in it, Jack collects rocks, he used to have a pet rock, have you, if you've lost your pet rock have you, um, we're going fossil hunting, that's an interesting rock that, yeah, your pet rock, it's... what? Jack said that he thinks his pet rock went on vacation. Another Americanism. We say holiday here. Jack just said he thinks his pet rock went on vacation. How you doing, Agnes? Yeah. I'm not going to teach Jack about the Dunnocks, though. I think that's way too... Um, yeah. It's weird, that rock. It's got, like, red in it, look. The dog's nearly had a sparrow. Jack! Jack, he's stressing them out. Quick, there's a nest there. It's too close. Listen to him. Oh, God. Did you hear the sparrows then? They thought Gizmo was going to attack their nest. They got all mad at him. Did you hear him? Going nuts. You wouldn't hurt them. Interesting rock, this, mate. Yeah. Definitely one for your collection. Can't wait to go start going to the beach. Take Gizmo and Jack's metal detector. Yeah? Finding what? Sorry, roots. Roots? So Gizmo started this. Yeah, it, and it is, there's, there's, a, there's, a, there's a Jurassic Coast along here. It, it is a Jurassic Coast. Um, and it's full of limestone. And our water is full of lime as well. It's really, really calcified. We have to use filters and stuff. That red's interesting, isn't it? That red there. There's so much round here, honestly. We're on like a um, Roman. They keep finding Romans, Roman stuff. They find a full chariot. <clears throat> yeah? Right, I want to go in. Jack, I'm cold now. The wind, sun goes in and it gets quite cold. Ninnywig wants to go in. Gizmo wants his din dins. I need a wee. You want your din dins, Mo? Where din dins? Daddy, if you're watching, can you get uh, Mo Mo's din dins ready, please? Did you look for those tail meals? Hello, Dave. Come on, Dave. Right, we're going in now. Yeah, very interesting rock, Jack. But the thing is, he collects rocks and doesn't have anywhere to put them. But yeah, his pet rock was pretty big. There's still loads of that fuzz left, you know. Forty-one likes, thank you. Oh, 
Gizmo definitely wants some to eat now. Come here, you silly pig. Come on. Oh, Ninny. Ninnywig. Where's Ninny? Where Ninnywig? No, we're eating Ninnywig. Jack is eating Ninnywig. Poo, quick. Jack, help. No, Jack. I can't. I've got two hands. Oh, j j help. No, no. Look who's this. Who's this? Quick. He's eating any with poop. Come on, come on, quick, quick. When he need, no, Jack, help, quick, help. I don't care, Jack. Gizmo's eating any with poop. That's more important than digging holes. I need to get Gizmo out of this pen, Jack. Oh my God, his tumor's getting bigger, Jack. Please help me. Get, get Oscar, Oscar. Get Momo out the pen. He's eating any with poop. Come on, out. Out! Shut the door, shut the door, shut the door, Jack, shut the door. Thank you. Where's Ninny? Oh! There's Ninny Wig. Where's Ninny Wig? Is that your Ninny? Ninny Wig. Ninny. Wait, you're not going back in there, there's poop in there. Did you just throw that, Jack? Oh, you're right, Mo. Have you got anything you'd like to add to the viewers about your experience today? This hoodie smells of uh, gizmo because. He's been sleeping on it. Jack, the dog, Gizmo. Yeah, it's been on my bed and he's been sleeping on it last night, so it smells of Gizmo. You smell Momo. But you love Momo. He's your friend, isn't he? Yeah. Right, well, come on, Jack. No more digging now. It's time to go in now. Anyone want to say anything to Ninny Wig? You do, don't you? Ninny. Ninny Wig. You want some Carol? Momo. Gizmo wants your rock, Jack. Can he have it? It's not food. Uh, no, you're not. He, he might put it in his den. I oh, know he is, Glenn. He's, he, he's obsessed. You're not eating it. I need to do his nails. Uh, he, they grow so quick. No, he's licking it. It's not food. Jack, he thinks it's food. Oh, he wants to chew it because of his teeth. That might be. Yeah, that'll help. Look at his teeth. Did you see that? His, uh, his new teeth have erupted next to his baby teeth. They haven't fell out. He might have to have an operation. You'll see him. You might see him anyway. No, he's thinking his tastes like pants. Don't blame you, mate. What's the matter? Yeah? Right, can you come out of there now, Jack? Because your dad won't... The gardener won't be very happy. And your dad won't be very happy that you're digging holes in the garden. Jack, can you pick up that white, please? It blows away completely. Hello, devil. How are you doing? Really, Ninny? Did you? Ah! Ah! Oh, my goodness. Jack blew out. Jack! Ah! Ah, help! Jack, we need to go in. It's getting worse. Can you guys hear the wind? Gizmo went straight to him. Oh, well done, Jack. This needs to go in the bin, that bud. Just put it in there. Oh, well, well. Actually, no, just, just give it here. I'll put it in my pocket. Needs to go in the bin, bud. Where's my pocket gone? Ninny wig's on my pocket. Ninny wig. Yeah, Ninny wig's a proper daddy's boy. No, you're not having the rock because you might try and eat it. 
Jack? Yeah. It's going no. Daddy, if you're watching, can you come and get Ninniwig, please? Ninni. Ninniwig. He's like this around his dad as well. He's kissing me now. He's kissing me. Look. You're licking me. Kisses for mommy. Oh, good boy. Can you hear him talking? Yeah, Hurricane Katie is really. It's a big one. I know that much. Can you guys hear Ninny Wiggle? Can you not hear him because of the wind? Can you hear him squeaking? What's that noise? I don't know if you anyone just answered me, you know. Can you, can you hear him, yeah? Jack, can you go and get Daddy? Jack, put that in the hole. Can you go and get Daddy and ask him to come and get Ninniwig, please? He didn't like that squeak then. Hello, Julius. We're just going in now. I hope you've enjoyed it anyway. Yeah, I don't I won't be streaming tonight. I'll do a pre-eclipse show tomorrow night and we'll look into CERN and we'll, we'll look into what's going on. It'll be on the Curious Bunny. So if you're not sub, sub up. All right, my love. <clears throat> Where are you going? Oh, we think he needs a wee. He wants to get down. Um, I'm just going to quickly put him on the floor in his pen just so he can have a quick wee. No, let him have a quick wee and then get him back, okay? Oh, oh go on then. No, I think he needs a wee. Because when he needs a wee, he starts, yeah. Have a wee wee then and then I'll get you back. He needs oh, a yeah, wee, I yeah. think. Yeah, he, well, he started like, you know when he starts acting like he needs a wee? But he's not had one. Oh, I need a wee really bad now. Tea's gone straight through me. They've taken so much of that fuzz. Have you been watching the stream? No, no, I missed it. Caught loads of it. There's still loads left, but they're literally loads of males. The males take it, not the females. Did you know that? So yeah. I didn't. Do, they, do the males make the nest or just take the materials? Or don't you know? Uh, yes, I think they go and get materials, the women, the women make the nests. He's trying to eat Ninny Wig Poo. Ninny, come here. No, no, no don't do that. Come on. Thanks both. No, Jackie's got the poo again. Yeah. Nin yes, no, my mouth. Hey, come on, you. Come on. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed the chaos. It's been a bit nuts, this one. The unplanned ones are always the best, aren't they? Don't you think? Mini wig. He always plucks Al's uh, beard. So cute, doesn't he? Yeah. He starts plucking him, grooming him. He loves uh. his daddy. He's such a daddy's boy, aren't you? You daddy's boy. Yeah, daddy's boy. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Nini wig. Yeah, he grooms him. He grooms his dad, but it actually hurts because obviously he thinks it's fur. Nini wig does, and he starts grooming him. He's not doing it yet, is he? He's about to though. He's thinking about it. He loves his dad. Right, anyway. No, I'm not going to do that tonight. No, I've got I've got too much to do. I've got to start doing some uh, cleaning and stuff now. So. Uh, is that a bee? Um, do you know what else? Quickly, they found two nests of Asian hornets by me. And um, Jack, they've, they've been, they, we need to, they, any, any sightings, you have to kill them and report them. They've come over. Uh, in this area. Area? Yeah, up the road. Um, no, uh, not, not this exact road, honestly. Up the road, which way, that way or that way? <laughs> oh, that way. man. No, uh, in this area, and they, they wait outside honeybees hives and then they kidnap the honeybees and 
they they kill them. It is really messed up, Jack. They chop them up and then feed them to their larvae. Asian hornets. Apparently they've destroyed the ecosystem in France. Did you know about that? They've destroyed the ecosystem in France. Um, hornet. They're hornets. Not normal hornets that we have here. They're massive things. They're like that big and they've got like a red... I bet they don't add to pollination, do they? No, they, they, they are a parasite species. They take what others have. So they, they sit there and they, they wait for the honeybees to, till they're coming out or going in with their pollen all over them and then they chop them up alive. They kill the dude that they chop them up while they're still alive. And then they feed them to their larva. They're just vile things. Yeah, See, I don't, I don't like killing anything, but I'd kill one of them. Well, they need to be killed because they're killing the bees. The bees yeah, are no. the ones that are keeping the flowers going. There's no flowers, no. They've no destroyed fruit, the though. ecosystem down in, in South of France. Yeah. Um, oh, the bird was about to get some stuff then. Jack, come on, because I want to go in now. Yeah, it was in the local news yesterday. Right, guys. You, hello, Jules. Yeah, I'm going to leave this up, folks. It, I'm just going to warn you now, if you've missed it, it's a pretty intense stream. We're in the middle of a storm. Storm Kathleen. Thanks both for dropping the curious bunny. Um, it's been a bit chaotic, shall we say. Hello, Agnes, love. Oh, blind. Hello, Saskia. Just waiting for Jack to go and get his ball. Dogs waiting as well. Bow bow. Bow bow. He's a mo. Gizmo. Mama dog. I've got all these songs for him. Gizmo dog. Mama dog. Oh, he loves his belly rubs as well, doesn't he? Gizmo dog. What the hell's that up there? That bird. Is that a seagull or is it something else? See it? It's huge. What is it? It's a pterodactyl. It looks like a pterodactyl. Right. Okay, let's go now. So Jack's definitely million percent going to your thing next week, Jack, alright? Go and put your ball, kick your ball under the trampoline. Yeah, Jack missed it today. Really upset. No, Jack, don't kick it over. Right, thanks everyone. If you're watching on the replay, we've got the replay crew. It was just a nice chill garden stream, but it was in the middle of a storm and it did get rather chaotic. We've had ladybirds, pigeons, sparrows. Uh, what else did we add? We had snail gate. We had a spider in my tea. Um, Gizmo doing snake kips to Jack, um, fighting every banana. It's been all go. You what, Jack? drama and sparrows uh, oscar fur has been um spread around the town oscar's dna is all over the baby chicks a black pigeon yeah it's been interesting pigeon yeah and mama chasing piggy ons so i don't even yeah locks to tell the lady i just don't no 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 jack 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 get your dog now get your dog get your dog no no, he's getting, he, he's hungry. Go and tell Danny to do his dinner. He got one. It was sod. He's eating, oh, I've got gizmo fur in my mouth now. Anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow. As on to the list, yeah. Um, tomorrow night we'll be there on the kit. Jack, 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 go and get him, go and get him. Yeah, I'm going to call this live spring watch in the middle of a storm. Yeah. Right, take care guys. I think you're all awesome. Please hit the like, 47 likes. Um, whoa, take care, lots of love. Bye. Jackie's having a wee.